deltoid, okay, the deltoid is named after the shape like a triangle. So the deltoid has a really wide origin, originates on the scapula, the acromion here, and then a little bit of the clavicle. Um, so it has a lot of actions. It can flex, extend, rotate, abduct the arm. Uh, so here's our spine of the scapula. Above it we have the supraspinatus. Then we have the infraspinatus. We can see a separate muscle here. And this is our teres minor. And this is our teres major. Okay. So for rotator cuff muscles, the rotator cuff includes the supraspinatus, the infraspinatus, the teres minor, and then also the subscapularis, which is this muscle here. Okay. Um, the other muscle you need to know that you can see um, from this view is this one, and this is the coracobrachialis. That begins on the coracoid process of the scapula and inserts onto the humerus. Okay. So that's it for this arm model for the test.